In today's video, we're going to learn how to read and write a fraction. So we've already learned how to split a brick into half, and how to split a brick into quarters. Now we're going to learn how to read and write fractions. Here are two bricks. What if half of these bricks were red? There are two bricks all together, and one of them is red. This is what a fraction looks like for one half. The bottom number is the whole amount, which in this case is two bricks. This is called the denominator. The top number is the part, which in this case is one red brick. This is called the numerator. Let's have a look at one quarter. Here are four bricks, and one quarter of the bricks are blue. There are four bricks all together, and one of them is blue. This is what a fraction looks like for one quarter. The bottom number is the whole amount, which in this case is four bricks. So the denominator is 4. The top number is the part, which in this case is one blue brick, so the numerator is 1. What if we changed the numerator? How does that change the fraction? If I change the numerator to 2, that means the parts have changed. How many blue bricks should I have now? I should have 2 bricks out of 4 that are blue. Let's try changing it again. If I change the numerator to 3, how many blue bricks should I have? I should have 3 bricks out of 4 that are blue. What do you think would happen if we change the numerator to 4? This means that out of 4 bricks, all 4 of them should be blue. Notice how the denominator hasn't changed. It's still 4. That's because the whole amount has always been out of 4. Here are five minifigures. Look at them carefully, as I'm going to ask you five questions about them, and I want you to write down your answers as a fraction. You can pause the video after each question to give you time to think about your answer and write it down. We'll go through the answers at the end of the challenge. Question one. What fraction of the minifigures are wearing hats? Question 2. What fraction of the minifigures are wearing the colour blue? Question 3. What fraction of the minifigures are holding something? Question 4. What fraction of the minifigures have blonde hair? And finally, question 5. What fraction of the minifigures are wearing black trousers? Let's see how you got on. So question 1 said what fraction of the minifigures are wearing hats? Only one minifigure is wearing a hat. So the answer is one fifth. Question 2 said what fraction of the minifigures are wearing the colour blue? Three minifigures are wearing the colour blue. So the answer is three fifths. Question three said what fraction of the minifigures are holding something? Four minifigures are holding something. So the answer is four fifths. Question 4 said what fraction of the minifigures have blonde hair? Two minifigures have blonde hair. So the answer is two fifths. Question 5 said what fraction of the minifigures are wearing black trousers? All five minifigures are wearing black trousers. So the answer is five fifths. Question 6 